Oscar de la Hoya Pix Gilberto Ramírez Tustov Dimitri Vivol. Oscar de la Hoya Believes Gilberto Zurdo Ramírez y Soy Nengasmenti Ni Speed Mobility of Into War LL Knockout to the Light Heavyweight Champion Dimitri Vivol on November 5. From the Hoya says I want to make a Gilberto vs Canelo Álvarez fight in 2023 if Zurdo successfully gets past Vivol. That doesn't seem too likely. As Canelo ha already ruled out a fight with Ramirez due to his decision not to face Mexican fighters. For the record, Vivol is the favorite with odds make due to his superior hand speed, mobility, and technical ability. Also, Vivol is the far better combination puncher. Ramirez, 44-0, 30 cos, you have looked price low since moving to 175 in 2019. And it's difficult to imagine him suddenly gaining spread at 31 ahead of his crucial fight against Vivol, 20-0, 11 cos, on the zone at the Etihad Arena, Abu Dhabi. Not only because of his size, not only set. I like the way he's throwing combinations. It's being very elusive. Vivol is a fighter that wants to wait for you. He wants to make mistake, the way that he would wait for Canelo. Canelo would throw and punch, and that was it, and I was countering. Left handed you the right game plan. Es offsetting him, wants to throw a lot of combinations, and he has a lot of conditioning, which will be key in Abu Dhabi. Street to one, I love it, set la olla about Zurdo Ramirez being an underdog against Vivol. It is seen fire. Street to one, I have the chance to beat the world champion, who beat the man, Canelo Álvarez. If it was a 2-1, I was a little, world, but 3-1? I'm going to go with Zurdo to make me knock out Vivol. I would love to make Zurdo vs Canelo Zurdo vs Canelo next year with Vihage. An all out Mexican war. I strongly feel Zurdo can put a number on Canelo. I think que can knock him out. I mean, left handed is a big way. It's looking ripped, it's looking fast, it's looking strong. I would love to see that fight, said La Hoya.